It's International Education Week. The U.S. State Department and Department of Education teamed up to develop this celebration. Uh, today, several international students at NMU gave a presentation on their own country's culture. TV6's David Jackson has the story. NMU's International Education Services invited NMU students to join their Passport to the World event Tuesday to broaden their perspectives of the world. Well, I was hoping through this event that students can do some armchair traveling. Not every student can afford to travel around the world. And I also just wanted the international students to get a chance to tell us about where they come from. The United States is the most popular destination for students studying abroad in the world. Some students say studying within other cultures is the best way to understand a new people and to get ahead yourself. Asia is always kind of looking forward to follow their trend at the same time retain our own identity. So it's like if you want to know how to get better, you kind of have to come to the States and see what people are doing here. University staff say there is no better way to learn a language. You can try to learn a language here domestically, but there's nothing like uh, being completely immersed in a culture to, to learn a language. Students say one of the primary reasons to study in the U.S. is to get a visa in hopes of one day being able to become a citizen themselves. They also say education is done differently here. In Korea, there is very limited and tight curriculum as compared with the United States because I didn't have any time except studying economics in Korea. But here, I can I, I, now I'm studying like photography. American students studying abroad say the same about learning another culture. One student says language can be a barrier and discourage some, but a little effort on your own part can get locals to open up and teach you more than any classroom. Just be open and be willing to make mistakes with the language. As long as, from my experience, if you try, people think that's really neat. It'll be either funny or they'll under, it'll, be, it'll open that doorway between you and the person. In Marquette, I'm David Jackson for TV6 News.